be like, damn, slow down. I know you see a cleaner just to her crown. She be knocked down, but she never stayed down. She be living life like it's her playground. And they be like, damn, slow down. They can't get just, she be moving too fast. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, please do not forget to subscribe. In today's video, we are going to be talking about a Kansas City mother by the name of Tasha Hayes. On February the 15th, around 11.45 that Tuesday night, the police received a phone call from Tasha stating that she was attacked by the devil. This was not the first call that Tasha had made to the police. They actually confirmed that throughout that week, they had been receiving very strange phone calls from Tasha where she was stating that she was hearing noises in her home, someone's in her home, and that, you know, she was under attack. Now, those phone calls were dismissed, but after this final phone call, the police did state that they wanted to do a wellness visit for her safety, not knowing exactly what they were walking into. When the police arrived to Tasha's home, they knocked on the door and when Tasha heard the knocking, she began to sing. She continued to sing every time they knocked, even though the police were announcing that they were calling to respond to the call that she made to them stating that she was being attacked. Without hearing them, she continued to sing and sing and sing. The other officers began to walk around the home just to look in any windows to see if there was a threat to Tasha for her own safety now that they are concerned regarding what appears to be her mental state of mind. When they began to walk around the house, they did peek into a window and one of the officers saw a body part of a child. In that same viewpoint, they could see Tasha and see that she was covered in blood. After that, they had to do what was right and barge through the home. When they opened up the home, Tasha did confirm that she was attacked by the devil. They were able to find a six-year-old little boy by the name of Carvel Stevens, which is Tasha's son. When they found him, he was decap his head was decapitated and he was deceased. They did also search the home and find their family dog in the same condition. Tasha has two other children that have been removed from the home and she has been charged with first degree murder and armed criminal action. She's currently being held without bond. Now there, the family that has the two other children has opened up a GoFundMe for six year old Carvel Stevens to help them pay for funeral funds as well as pay for a new start for the two other children. While I was looking into this story, I did see that people have have already came out and stated that they know Tasha and they can attest that she always has appeared to be off in some way shape or form they did say that they never thought that she would do something like this however nonetheless this is very sad in that we as a community need to look into the mental health of mothers the local prosecutor, Jean Baker, did speak out and state that they're going to do their due diligence to look into this case entirety to see if there was any part of um, a family visit that was missed, if there was any chance of intervention that was missed, or any failed processes throughout the time that Tasha Hayes had her three children, as we know, it's Carvel Stevens and two other children. She did state that you know, even though she's saying this, they still don't know if this even is into play, that there was any charges prior to this or any intervention action that ever happened to this. She's just stating that they're going to look into this to make sure that they did their part to protect their children. Now, there is a, you know, a, a goal of reform. There is a goal for helping children because we have to continue to protect our community's youngest, in her words. Now, without further ado, please don't forget to subscribe and like this video on your way out. I will talk to you guys in another one.